New York City is considering new regulations this morning to counter its largest outbreak of Legionnaire's disease. The disease has killed seven people and infected 86 others in the city since July 10th. Legionella bacteria has been found in five cooling towers in the South Bronx. Dr. Holly Phillips is with us. Holly, good morning. Good morning. We've talked about this before. Is this growing? Do we need to be concerned? You know, this is a, a huge outbreak. In fact, it's the largest outbreak in New York City's history. Uh, so cooling towers are a part of the ventilation and air conditioning system on large buildings, usually commercial buildings, not small residential buildings or homes. Uh, what they do is they have water inside uh, and they cool air that goes through ventilation systems. The bacteria bacteria can live and grow in the water and it gets introduced inside of buildings in small water droplets and you breathe it in. Okay, so now that that has been determined the source, these air mm -hmm. cooling units, you have 8 million plus people or more living in New York City and then certainly more than that working here. Does that open up a whole bunch of people to this? potential disease. Right. Right now, this outbreak seems to be contained within these five buildings and the five cooling towers in them in the South Bronx. But it really does raise a really important question, which was uh, addressed yesterday in a press conference. The city does not inspect cooling towers on a regular basis. It's up to the building to maintain them. And there may need to be new regulations around that, since clearly these aren't, weren't maintained as well as they should have been. But is that what makes us more concerning than others, the fact that there's no regulation on, by the city and we don't know how far it might be. Well, right now they think that they've gotten all of the sources. They looked at dozens, actually more than 22 cooling towers in the in the area, and they think that they've gotten those sources and cleared them. Right now, the uh, infection or the outbreak seems to have peaked because the number of new cases is dropping. However, uh, Legionella has a up to a 14-day incubation period. Mm. So there might have been people who were exposed before they've cleaned out these towers who will show symptoms later. So and it might not be over. If you've been exposed, what should you do? Absolutely get to your doctor. It can be treated with antibiotics, but those are most effective if they're started early. So don't hesitate. All right. Thank you, Dr. Holly Phillips.